the LG B20 user here, and today I'm doing a video about LG. So I'm on friendlyman.com here, and it says here LG said it planned the G7 Thank You notch designed for Apple. So that's what um LG claimed that they um they that's what they claimed that they um that they planned a uh, top notch for the G7 before Apple. So um that's what they claim, but I think it's fucking funny how. You know, I think it's funny, you know what I'm saying? So let's get check this shit out, dude. This shit's very funny and <laughs> shit's funny, man. It says we reckon there's a shades of smartphones featuring a notch design, something that many attributed to Apple's iPhone X, even though the central phone was the first phone to bring it into the public scrutiny. Still every time another notch flies to business official People tend to believe that it copied Apple's iPhone X. That may be true in some cases, but it doesn't apply to all smartphones that embrace the notch design lately. For example, LG's new G17Q strongly resembles the iPhone X when it comes to the display design, but the software and giant denies it copies Apple's product. According to LG's mobile division chief, his company planned the notch design before Apple. He also said that, the, that LG prefers to call the new feature a second display rather than a notch, which might imply that something is missing. LG's official claims that while the design of the G7 may look similar to that of other well-known flagship smartphones, it offers different features. On the side note, Wang confirmed that Wang confirmed that while the G7 doesn't feature the gimmicky AR-based emojis, they will be added via software update later on. Are you serious? So I mean, I mean, <sighs> LG claim that they um they they claim that they are uh, planned the knots for the uh, G7 or whatever. You know, I just think it's funny. Um, that's what LG claims. If there's um documentation to back this up. That's great, but until then, but until then, this is just fucking crazy. Um, you know, you know, you know, a lot of people, you know, a lot of companies are now kind of are are going the notch route, like LG did it with the G7, Asus did it with the Zenfone 5. Um, uh, while we did it with the P20. You know stuff like that. The essential frame was the first frame to have the notch, um, but their notch was small for the front-facing camera in their uh, speaker. And, and I mean the front-facing camera in the earpiece on the essential phone. And then Apple had the wide notch on the um, iPhone X, and that's why everyone else is taking that and putting it on their phone. So. I mean, this shit's fucking crazy. If there's actual documentation proving that LG planned the notch design of the G7 before anyone did, then let us see the documentation. Because right now, I'm treating this as a fucking... Dude, this shit is just fucking funny. It, it's funny that's what LG claimed that they... I mean, I mean, this shit's fucking funny, dude. It's... It's fucking funny, dude, that, you know... Is it pro is do y'all got proof of it? Or are y'all just sitting there just fucking just sitting there just making up shit? You know what I'm saying? Um and it says at the bottom of the article here, it says that the um um it says that it's gonna get the AR uh it's gonna get the AR emoji um type thing It'd be a software update later on. So that's gonna be interesting to see about that. They're taking, they're taking the page from Samsung's book there. 
as you guys know, Samsung copy Apple on the a AR emoji thing. Samsung copy Apple. God damn it, man. Yeah, and it says here, as you guys see the last sentence, says the G17 key don't, don't feature the gimmicky AR based animated emojis. They are they will be added via software update later on. So it is coming to the G7. Oh my god, dude. Dude, the AR emoji, the thing, the AR emoji thing is stupid. The N emoji is fucking stupid. Those are the stupidest things that I, those are the stupidest things that I have ever seen on a fucking phone. It's, those are stupid. It's gonna get as fuck. It's stupid, man. I mean, yo, LG man, like, provide us with documentation that you said that you said that you planned the not design for the G7 before Apple did. Let us see documentation of that, because right now I don't believe your fucking eyes. I think you're just making up shit. I think you just wanna, I think you just wanna stir the fire in the pie. I think you just wanna do claim that you came up with the notch first before anyone else did. I think that I think you know I think that's the only reason why LG's doing it so that they can say that they came out they came up with, with the nice design first before anyone else did. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't believe LG's I don't know what LG's reason is behind this. I think they're just trying to just fucking fuel the fire here. I mean, there you know, you obviously get, you got you know two sides to the, to the knots thing. You got people that's okay with the knots. You got people that don't, don't that don't like the knots. I am one of those people that do not like the knots. I think it's stupid, but that's just my opinion. Um, but LG man, come on man, have facts to back it up. Don't 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 just fucking say oh we fucking playing the G7 uh knots design before Apple did blah 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 blah. I mean, the G7 is a nice phone on the back and it has great features on it, but the notch, no thanks, man. Um, so what the uh, so what do you guys think LG's reason is? What do you guys think LG's reasoning is behind them saying that they planned the G7 notch design before anyone else did? What is your opinion about this shit? I think this shit is, I think this shit is fucking funny. And I think LG is just, I think LG is, LG is, is just, just trying to just stir the pot and just trying to put shit on top of it. Because like I said guys, yeah, as you guys probably know, there are people that like the notch and there's people that don't like the notch, you know what I'm saying? You know. And they're going to now, like if you read it on um, my article here, like I said, like the last sentence of the article, and it says that, uh, um, the G7 doesn't feature the gimmicky AR and emoji things, but it's coming via software update later on. So we'll have to wait and see about that. So they're basically now LGs are gonna be, be dick riding Apple and Samsung on the um and emoji crap, which I said it's fucking stupid. I'm not a fan of that. I think that's the stupidest fucking gimmicky shit ever on a phone. It's gimmicky as fuck. I never tried it. But I just know it's fucking stupid in my opinion, so yeah man, what do you guys what do you guys think about this shit man? I think this shit's funny man. If this shit is true what LG is saying, they gotta have shit to back it up. They can't just fucking just fucking just make up shit man, cause you know people going oh, like no uh uh you know the central fan as you guys know is what's the first one to have the not as you guys know then Apple the Apple iPhone 10 was the second one to have the notch. The iPhone 10 was the first one to was the first one to have a wide notch, and that's why Asus, Asus is coming in a Huawei, LG here. God damn it, LG man! I mean, if you got facts to back it up, let us know about it, man. Don't 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 just sit there and just make up shit, man. You know what? I'm. You know what? I'm actually gonna try to email LG and see if I can get anything off of this shit. Cause I, I'm. I'm gonna try to email LG and see if they'll give me any answers about this. Cause I'm curious about this. 
they uh, they they uh, they, uh, they probably won't tell you nothing. If you try to email LG or something, they probably wouldn't tell you nothing. They they might not respond to you. They may not. So I'm gonna try to email LG and shit like that about this because I'm curious about this shit now. Um. So I just want to know is this shit's probably all bullshit, but man, it's, I I just think it's fucking funny that LG said that they planned the G7 not design before Apple did. I mean, come on, man. Do you guys believe what LG is saying, or do you guys think it's a fucking lie, man? I think this shit's fucking funny. I think this shit's funny. Uh, I mean, if this shit's true, like I said, guys, you know, LG has to have facts to back it up, you know what I'm saying? Because, you know, a lot of people are, a lot of people are going to say that LG is a lion, which I'm sure they are, and I'm sure the LG is lying too, you know what I'm saying? Um... Yeah, man, so like I said, I'm going to try to email LG and see if I can get any uh, any information on this shit. Because I'm, I'm interested to see if they really did do that. And I'll do another, I'll do an updated video if I get anything back from LG on this. Shit's interesting as fuck. But I think LG is fucking just fucking themselves here. They're, they're just trying to stir the pot, man. They're, they're just trying to fuel the fire in the pot, man. They're... They're putting this shit on, man. And they're and they and they and they're gonna make the uh, they're, and they're gonna make this shit worse by adding the AR emoji thing via software update to the G7 later on. What did you get? What do you guys think about that shit too? I mean, goddamn, LG, what the fuck are you doing, man? You claiming all this shit? You got facts to back it up? Tell us. Spill the beans, LG. Come on, spill the goddamn beans, man. So, um, yeah, man, if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. It really helps me out a lot. Peace and great. Come subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.